Hey everybody, Yeti here, and welcome back to episode 15 of my Oblivion Permadeath. Um, yes. I have made a decision that I'm going to make these episodes a little bit longer. Instead of going around the 20 minute mark, I'm going to make them around the 30 minute mark. Um, the reason for that being is just because I want to start getting through these a little bit quicker, because I really want to start, as much as I'm like really enjoying this episode, I really, this episode, this series, um, I really want to start... Yo, dude, what? <laughs> oh, I was looking at the wrong marker, that's why. Leading me outside the city. Um, yeah, I really want to start uh, my new permadeath, which will be voted by you guys. Um, by now, I think it will have been already voted on, but. Um, From the blades, did you say? Joffrey's. I don't know yet because I haven't actually put the video up because I'm recording this, this beforehand, as always. I've been plead. Right, what did he just say? Um, the head of the elite. He was unable to promise any soldiers from the Imperial since they are all tied down fighting the Dage Invasion. He suggested ask the council. Council. Okay, well, that's pretty much what I'm already doing. So, thanks for that suggestion, you useless piece of arse. Let's try Coral. I've always said Coral, but I've heard some people say Charl. Those people are doing their life wrong. Oh, there's a gate outside here. I better not have to do that gate. I'm looking on the thing by the way bottom left. There's a gate outside the city. I'm probably gonna have to close another freaking gate. Right, where's the door here? It's this, isn't it? Yes. It's probably gonna be in bed because it's late. If I do have to do it, I'll at least be able to do it this episode. Yeah, he's not here. Put your sword away. So let's wait until the morning. Okie doke. He should be here now. Here we go. Oh it's a woman. Bunge. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Francis Bell. Brilliant. Aether Bruma. As the head of the Elder Council. While I understand Bruma's need, I can No. Goodbye. Wait, did she say If I say he wasn't threatened? Uh, we've got to do another freaking gate. Uh, if I die in this gate, I'm just going to accept it. Previously, if I died, I would I probably would have been like, ah, oh, I didn't die, what are you talking about? And would have just like restarted the episode. Because I save at the start of each episode anyway. Or maybe not. <laughs> I didn't save. I'm not saying, okay, so usually I would, typically. Where's the city actually at, though? Where even is the city? I know that's Wayne and Priory. I think it's it behind it. Oh, there's the city. Okay, yeah, I can see why they think this is a threat. But this is just the same thing again. It's kind of repetitive. I, I don't know if you guys don't see why these annoy me, then you're blind or some shit. But yeah, I can see why this is a threat, but it's just the same thing again. Like the idea of her saying, oh, I'm not going to send my troops when there's an oblivion gate outside. And then you have to go and shut it, and then she lets you get the troops. That makes sense as an idea, but the fact that I've done that twice now, and I might have to do that again, just kind of annoys me. And this one's got so many more towers. Fucking one, two, there's seven towers in this. The stone's up there, because I can see the fire and stuff. How do I get there? Hey, keep an eye on my health. Yeah, previously I would have just like tried to load a save and do it again. But at this point... I'm not gonna like go on way to kill myself or anything, but I'm gonna I'll still like be not trying not to die. But if I do happen to die, then I will straight up end it. Tsunami. I could just walk right through that gap. You're talking shit. Okay. This actually looks really awesome, like in third person like this, with my like badass armor and my my awesome katana and the rhymes. And then my wolf shield. Ah, oh, dude, this looks so awesome. Uh, eruption gate. Right, I'm not going to stop playing in third person. Let's do this. No! Okay. So where am I going then? I guess this way. Dude's head on a stick. Nice. His brain plooped out. Oh, here's an entrance. So these are bridges to the middle one. Hopefully 
Yeah, but there's this whole thing of like the big gates that are opened elsewhere. I was gonna say hopefully I can literally just sort of climb to the top of this tower and then walk across and then that's it. Oh shit. Oh, fuck. No, stop. Bring it down. Corp smasher. Oh neat. Oh, so they stick someone on this and then that crushes the corpses or something? Ow. Walking into this dick hurt me, that's kind of ridiculous. Did a decent amount of damage too. Okay then. I wonder if they like lay someone flat on this hole. Oh shit. Would it like impale them? Probably not, it's not going fast enough. Eh, uh, maybe. I could see some impaling with that. But let's just move on here. Okay. Howdy ho, how is everyone doing? There's some floor missing there. Oh, there's another elevator. Oh, this is a cage. Oh, snap. He's gone. Rib. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, it was only a skeleton. Oh, really? Is this actually just going to lead straight across? Please say this leads straight across. Because I can see all this, like, labyrinth here. Yeah, there is no way. What, wait, what, where is it? Let me just jump here. Oh, can I not get over that? Oh, there's a thing in the way. Where's the sigil stove? Okay. Why are you still oblivion? That takes me through the... Oh, this is just a hub. It's like all the other towers. How do I know which tower to go to? Oh, for fuck's sake. I can't be arsed with this challenge game. At least they are changing the... Um, the oblivion portal things up a little bit. How do I get up there? Tornado. At least it's not like the exact same thing every time. What? What? He just jumped. It's opened by a winch. Well, you released the cage prisoner. Wait, he was alive? Oh dear. <laughs> I didn't actually see him hit the ground because he went out of the render distance. Which is a, a bit annoying considering it's maxed, but hey. So I guess I'll just go to the bottom and see if there's anything. Am I gonna have to do each tower individually? Here's the door for this. What's this? Another a bridge, okay. Yeah, I don't know if I wanna be here. I wanna be like all the way up there. This remind what well, this reminds me of if you've ever played um Diablo 2, uh, at the end of Act 2, when there's like 12 tombs and like I don't remember if it's one of them has the way like a portal into the next area or something or if it's like three of them have something in I don't quite remember but essentially there's like 10 or 12 tombs or something but some of them are just like completely useless and some of them have what you need so you have to like work your way through and do like each tomb until you find what you need that was fun though this is just a pain honestly Try a different tower. Let's just work my way around. Like in my opinion, I love this game. Don't get me wrong. But in my opinion, the main quest is probably one of the worst parts of this game. Probably one of the downfalls for it. I'm pretty sure these are all exactly the freaking same. That opened the tsunami gate. Okay. Does that help me though? Where's the tsunami gate? It's underneath me? I think it might be underneath me actually. No, get up, get up, get up. I can't get up. I'm stuck on the side of this thing. Just lift your foot up. Please? I don't see where the tsunami gate actually helps me though. Yo. Can I make it out of this?
That was my own fault entirely, though, for walking off the edge. That was so. If I die here, this is over. Yo, dude, we did it. I'm not dead. What a legend! How did I, I just fell off that bridge and didn't die. I am brilliant at video games. Don't even deny it. Some fleshy pods over there. Let's take these guys out because they're annoying. I don't even deny how awesome that was. How do people end up here though to die in the first place? So that's the tornado gate which we already opened. And then that was the tsunami gate which we just opened. I don't see how that's useful for anything though. Because now we can get into Hurricane, but we could have just got into Hurricane from the hub up there, right? Oh no, that's not on the same layer. Oh, I don't know. This is annoying and confusing. So I guess I want to ride this to the top. Oh, that lever's only there. I thought I had to press the lever and then jump on it. The lever's only there if like, you're at the bottom. And this is at the top. Oh, and the same here. Right, okay. Like if you're not on the same level as the elevator. So that leads to a bridge. This is going to lead back to the hub, right? I'm going to go up here because if there's like a lever or something which is useful, then it'll be up here, won't it? There is nothing up here, okay. No, there's nothing here, right, okay. That's alright then, I guess. I guess we're going to have to go back into the wastes. The gate's all over there. What is that in the sky? It looks like a needle pointing at it. Right, so we're back into the this place. I don't know what to do. I'm so confused. Rending calls. Oh, this... Is this where we came from before, then? See if I can find a staircase. Oh, this is going up. This is going up. Please don't tell me that entire thing was pointless. What was the point in any of that, though? It just didn't seem like that was actually doing anything. Like, or any of that was necessary. Chill. Chill. I know I'm not done yet, but... So far, it seems like all that stuff was just a waste of time. So far. Watch this be a dead end now. Okay, we're at full health. Okay, this is going up. As long as we're going up, we're making progress. And so far, we just went up quite a decent amount, so... Corridors of Dark Salvation. That sounds familiar, actually. Maybe I have done this. Okay, more going up. I need to keep an eye out of traps. I don't know what they look like, though. Okay, let's just keep going. Okay, this is back to the hub thing. Oh, okay, I think we're finally here. Sigillium Santius. So that entire bit with all the different towers and the, the gates and shit, that was all pointless. Why? Why was that there? That just wasted my time. This is what annoys me with this. I can't I still keep checking those just in case the teleporters, even though completely unnecessary. But then why would they have the teleporters in that very first? Playing if they weren't going to be used again. It's like introducing the, the mechanic and then just ne never using it. No, that chill is dead. Come back here, there we go. And this one. I should check in case these guys have anything. I'll take a Dramora, what, mace now that I can actually carry one? Take two now and carry them. Okay, I can't carry them. Both the exact same condition and stuff. Oh, that's the chill scout, so I'll just kill the chill. He's gone. Did I kill him? He did, nice. He just fell off the edge. So maybe there was something good in here. Not really. Someone scam. Why is it taking us that long to get that? 
I can actually move for this one. Usually I can't move for these. Okay. Oh, that took unnecessarily long. Unnecessarily long. I can walk to the castle now. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> Things like that would just make me look forward to the new um the new permadeath, which I don't know what it's gonna be yet. Wait on you guys. And also I do a vote. I, I don't know if I actually want to do a vote yet. I'm not sure what I'm thinking it's about a it. To me. A pleasure to meet you. Your reputation. Fuck's sake. I, I should nearly kill myself on the mission that you sent me on. Goodbye. That should be enough allies. What are Bruma doing actually? Do they just need some allies to defend themselves? Because it's like why do they need so many allies? Coral's like twice the size of Bruma. Okay. Her best soldiers to help defend Bruma. I guess maybe they're defending the Cloud Ruler Temple then. As well. This isn't done though. They need more troops. He's taking the piss. If I have to do one more Oblivion Gate for troops, I'm gonna freak. Not full health, there we go. The restoration skill increased. This town's pretty nice too, actually. They all are. Is this a town with like the painter where he gets trapped in his own painting and he has to find like painted trolls? That's pretty awesome. It's a pretty awesome mission. It's pretty hard though. Right, who's next? Leoween, I haven't been to yet. Anvil, let's go to Anvil. I'm literally doing everyone. What's the town that's on like the far right? Oh, bruv oh, there isn't one far, far right. Oh, Chaden Hall. I forgot about Chaden Hall. I forgot about Brill. Breville even is just Leoween, which is over by itself. Okay, still three more towns to go, which isn't including Kavach. Which hopefully I don't have to do Kavach because I'm not finished the Kavach mission yet. So I'd have to actually like do the Kavach mission. They're like breaking the siege or whatever. Okay, so she should be here now, or if not, she'll be close. Uh, why walk when you can run? That's always been your motto. <laughs> okay, uh, apparently. Um, now the out, now the miles of running and hours of swimming have paid off. <laughs> What's swimming? I've been in the water like twice in the whole playthrough. You are an apprentice of athletics. Your rate of fatigue regeneration is oh by twenty five percent. That's actually pretty good. Hello. Good morning. I am Melona. I would like to send help to Bruma. Ah! Uh, I can't be bothered with another fucking Oblivion Gate. There's two more cities after this. Not including Gavach. That one's not even close. You're taking the piss. Taking advantage at this point. It's like this jokes just going on. Like, hey, this this Yeti guy is going to come and talk to you and ask for troops. Send send him out on Oblivion Quest. Send him out on the Oblivion. Just any any Oblivion Gates, whether it's a threat or not. Just send him out. He'll do it. Don't worry. Play a joke on him. Oh, fucker. No, this isn't a threat at all. This is way too far away to even be considered a threat. I'm not... This is not a threat. You, I'm calling BS on this. Dude, the cities in this game look so nice, actually, to be fair. I do love this game. To be fair, like I said, I never did that... I never, like, got past halfway of the main quest anyway. Well, I didn't think I actually did barely any of it, but apparently I did more than I thought, because I keep recognising stuff. But yeah, I never really got past halfway of the quest. So, this is why I'm getting particularly annoyed now, because not only did I never actually have to do all these Oblivion Gates, just because I never got around to it, but on top of that, I'm, ha I'm like doing them all at once right now. So that's just like adding to the annoyance, pretty much. Okay. You know what, I'm just going to run run my way through because I can't be bothered dealing with this. And I'll do the same for the other two if I really do have to do two other Oblivion Gates. But then I'll keep getting like harder and, well, quote unquote harder. I think the last one was sort of artificially harder. Like it was supposed to be harder with like the new stuff, but then it, it actually the new stuff was completely pointless. Oh, I think I recognise this one. How am I going to get the tops of these rocks? 
You see, the more I play, the more I start to recognise stuff. I think maybe actually I played more of this than I thought I had. Now, do I have to go and do that tower or not? Oh, nether tunnels, I missed that. Oh no, it's like halfway up the mountain though, isn't it? Yeah, it's like halfway up the mountain or something, the entrance. Oh, never mind, it's right there. Nether tunnels, hopefully this leads somewhere good. I feel like it might actually not. Oh, that's going down. We want to go up. I'm going to go down though. I kind of feel like just streaming this and just streaming like three hours and just do all of these but because I'm like seven episodes ahead at this point it wouldn't really work to stream it I'd have to like highlight on my Twitch channel and then just wait to upload it on YouTube and just be like no one go on my Twitch channel because you'll ruin everything so I'm not going to do that but oh my internet it just went it's kind of annoying I was trying to install Shadow of Mordor in the background. Limited. Uh, is it stopped since I'm Shadow of Mordor? Yeah, it has. Shit. Actually, it might have stopped a while ago, to be fair, because I have been... Game's been crashing, and I keep forgetting to restart it. I don't know why I mean that it's gone, but I don't I can really do about that. I'm not going to mess with it now when I'm trying to record. Yeah, I really need to stop recording Oblivion. I'm fucking addicted though, because I was like, gonna record some Pokemon Silver as well, and I was gonna record um, some Isaac today. I haven't. I'm like five hours later, and I'm still playing this game. I probably recorded like three hours or so. Oh, I can't actually see Audacity anymore. I need to be able to see Audacity so I can see how long I've been recording. I'm glad this episode is gonna be a bit longer because this is like a really bad place to stop. Great, that was that just took me on the other side of Oh that took me about eight feet to the left. Brilliant. Stop following me please. Anyone else wanna come out? No? Okay. Oh and this is a dead end too. Awesome. But yeah, I'll probably be taking a break after this one actually. I could probably be stopping recording Oblivion after this episode. And I'll do some silver or something. Not that, I don't know why I'm really saying this, because like, it means nothing to you guys. The episodes come out when they come out, but you know. Oh, I'm higher up the mountain! Oh, okay, you've redeemed yourself. I take back the shit I was talking. Still annoys me that that thing over there, the towers and stuff, it's completely useless. I know, I mean, there's probably some people out there which enjoy this, and that's like extra combat, and there's probably loot in them, but... Fucking hell, what was this called? The Red Nash Channels, okay. You know what, I do recognise this though, with the tunnels and stuff. It's like, I keep just being like, okay, this is all new territory, this is new territory, and then like, all of a sudden I'll recognise something, and I'm like, okay, maybe I did do this. Okay, now it's new, now it's new, now it's new, but like, now I'm here, and I recognise this as well. Yeah, I didn't feel like I was going up in the, the other tunnels, because I dropped down two floors before I started going up. And I didn't feel like I actually went up that much, that's, that's why I thought I was on the same level. I went down as much as I did up. These scams are definitely getting a little bit harder, though. I mean, they're still doing, like, no damage, but they have a bit more health, at least. Okay. Yo, dude, chill. I don't know. Oh, I'm actually kind of high up now. Whoa, what is this? It's shaking about. Oh, go away. I don't know why they're even trying. Shit, keep my health tops up. Cause yeah, I'm not doing that much, but there's quite a lot of them and they're pretty relentless. Where was that even aiming? He must have been aiming pretty high in the sky to get out that far. Okay. Just 
keep on going. Hey, dude. How are you? Dead. <laughs> I'm alright, because he's dead. Okay. Oh, uh, we finally fucking hit. This better be... Uh, I can see a tint of orange. Okay, I was going to say... I was looking at it, and I couldn't see any of the orange stuff. I was like, dude, this better be fucking it. If it was like that one tower that I was looking at at the bottom, like, what is that? I'd be pissed. The tower portal. Yes, finally. I must have got much further than I thought, because we haven't seen any of the normal Dramora dudes yet. Which is weird. We just keep getting the chills. Not like whatever the warrior dudes are called. Get back here. Oh, I didn't sell the Dramora mace. From the last one. Corridors of Dark Salvations. This is going to take me upwards, isn't it? Okay. Leave me a little. Hopefully none of those have had like a key on them or something. Pretty sure these guys are going to chase me all the way to the top. The gore steeple, did that say? Awesome. The Church of Eli Roth. <laughs> Is this going to take me up? Or... Down? I think that took me up. Oh nice, these are actually taking me up. That one didn't take me anywhere, okay. Okay, we're here, sweet. I wonder how many of these guys are actually following me at the moment. Probably not much, because I don't think they use the teleporters. Well, let me get this out so I can actually fight some dudes. I'm still only a level 3, and I've taken on like 5 Oblivion Gates. <laughs> yeah, this the level in this game is kind of weird. Like, I feel like... Oh, my knife... Oh, that's the blades, that's the blades, okay. And the fighters go to anyone. Look, level 3, I feel like... Considering I've taken on this many Oblivion Gates... And most of them were single-handedly. My weapon just broke. I feel like I should probably be a bit of a higher level. I don't think I have any repair things left. I have loads of those though. Maybe I should enchant my sword. I have this Dramora Mace now if I need it. But the Debaser does a bit more damage and it looks cooler. Actually, how does the Dramora Mace look? Actually, that looks pretty badass to be fair, but I think I prefer the way the Debaser looks. Okay, I made it. Yeah, so I think that's my fifth Sigil Stone, so I'll look at like what the best enchantment is. I'll probably like enchant my um, Blade Sword. Why can't I move during this bit all of a sudden? I used to not be able to move when it was like taking the portal away. Okay, one well, and there's imps out here. Oh yeah, they're still here. I should take these guys out as well, so not just like wander in the wastes. The wastes? Yeah, I played more Fallout than I played Oblivion. The, um, land, I guess, of Cyrodiil. Okay. Actually, I couldn't fast travel anyway. So I'll talk them out. Yeah, this is a nice area. I could have a house over there. Okay. Anyway. Castle Anvil. Oh, Anvil is one where, like, just off the coast, there's the... The Helm of... Fi the Finn Helm? Or something? Which is like a glass helm and it looks really awesome. And it lets you like breathe underwater and see in the night. But like in the daytime when you're wearing it, everything's like bright blue or something. Oh, and life detection as well. It gives you night vision, breathe underwater, and life detection. Sure and it's a glass helmet, so it looks pretty good. With Don't worry. It's unbelievable. Right in the... He's... Okay, I just got under the grass, which I'm not going to do. Just keep going. So, I still have to do... I'm not doing Gavach yet, because I don't want to do that quest. I still have to do Chaden Hall. Chaden Hall, and then... Breville. And Leowin. Jeez, this better, like, lead to the end or something, because this is taking forever. I think after this episode, I'll check like on the wiki for like the the quest list or something, and see if this is like close to the end. Cause fucking hell, this is taking forever. Where am I going? This way? Yeah, it's that door over there. Okay, let me talk to this dude, see if he gets us on another fucking quest, and then we'll wrap the episode up.
Oh, is this a sad one where, like... I don't know if this king is... I think this is a dude king? Yeah. Count, yeah, because, like, the countess is dead or something. So there's just flowers there. I don't have time to chat right now. With that oblivion gate looming up... My first responsibility... With an open... Ob Take care. Of course. Of course. Okay, so I think what I'm going to actually do... In the next episode... Um, is talk to... I've talked to Chaden Hall. Now, I think I'll talk to Breville. Oh, I can, oh damn it, I can only do one at once. I was going to say talk to Breville and talk to Leowin so that I get all the quests at once and then I can just do like a boss rush and do all the Oblivion Gates in a row. But I can only do one at once apparently because the um, dialogue's gone. Or the quest marker even. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, be sure to leave a like. Love it, just like your favourite. Um, yeah, if you want to follow me on Twitter for tweets, Twitter streams, links in the description as always. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode.